we're going to talk about mobility DNA. And I've got two colleagues with me today, Archana Keitan and Lewis Yamas. Archana, would you be able to talk me through mobility DNA? Really as a reminder and a refresh for everyone, as obviously we've launched many of the mobility DNA attributes over the past 12 months. Yeah, that's right. The mobility DNA is not new to Zebra. And we introduced mobility DNA with the TC75 launch last year. And very simply put, mobility DNA is our suite of administrator and developer tools, utilities and applications that play a vital role in making our mobile computers running Android operating system differentiated in the enterprise. With every new release, as Google continues to enhance the capabilities of Android, um, we continue to add capabilities um, on, the, on, on the mobility DNA side as well. For the enterprise customers, security and management are very important. But it is where commercial Android leaves ent enterprise requirements unfulfilled that we fill a, a void in the, uh, in the industry and we make Android easier for customers to deploy. So you mentioned around the fact that Google is making constant changes to its operating system. Is there a point in which mobility DNA might go away? Not truly, really, because as Google has begun to address the need of enterprise uh, market, and specifically with Android for Work initiative, they have begun to make investments in security and management needs for the enterprise. And where these capabilities are available, we leverage them. But our mobility extensions go extend far beyond that and provide greater control in some of these areas. Also note that Android features are only available to customers on a GMS device and often requires a Google account. And not all enterprise customers use GMS due to either country restrictions, forced update, or data privacy concerns. And lastly, the mobility DNA capabilities extend beyond the OS security and management into software solutions that drive greater efficiencies and productivity for our customers. So all touch TE, which we are introducing with the TC7K, is a good example for that. So you mentioned a couple of times uh, GMS. Some people in the audience might not know what that acronym stands for. Louis, are you able to just explain a little bit more detail about what this means um, and the, what it means really for the customers as well? Sure, sure, David. Uh, GMS stands for Google Mobility Services. These are typically the, 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 the components of Android that we're used to, uh, to uh, play with in our, in our standard phones. Things like Gmail, things like notifications, things like messaging, things of that nature, G Gmail, that are usually tied to an individual Gmail account. So GMS is really, in my mind then, saying it's more of the consumer side and non-GMS is much more enterprise related. Correct. Brilliant, thanks for that. So, Lewis, Mobility DNA has got a whole bunch of different uh, utilities and applications that are going to work brilliantly in the warehouse and with the TC8000. Can you just expand on a few of those for me? Sure, sure. So as uh, Android continues to expand in the commercial world and becoming the dominant uh, uh, platform in the commercial space, it's also starting to gain a lot of traction in the, in, the, in the enterprise space. Particularly Zebra's customers continue to invest in new use cases and new applications for, for Android. Uh, part of Mobility DNA, we provide several uh, foundational applications for that. For example, like Old Touch D that Archana here mentioned, uh, which is bringing the modern user interfaces and the, the simplified user interfaces to traditional applications without having to make any modifications to your back end. That makes it very simple, very useful, and very easy to migrate towards. Um, other applications such as Stage Now uh, are very useful for warehouses that not, do not have local IT support. You need to stage, provision, put applications in there, security, all the necessary things, and, and an application like Stage Now makes it very, very simple in any warehouse around the world. Another great example that simplifies and brings a lot of productivity to our customers is uh, another component called Simulscan. What Simulscan does is instead of just taking a barcode and decoding that, it takes a complete form that may have multiple barcodes, may have uh, tags here and there, may have numbers, even a signature, and then parse out everything and puts it in the right form without the, the user have to do multiple scans, multiple trigger press. That significantly increases productivity as well. Fantastic. So. What comes to mind is that you know, TC8000 is on an Android platform. What happens if someone wants to um, navigate, a bit bored, wants to go navigate to the Android um, menus, 
Can you stop that happening with some in the warehouse and their downtime? Yeah, great question because uh, a, a lot of the warehouse applications, they're, they're productivity based, so you don't want people navigating up some of the things that they have to. So we have a component of part of mobility DNA called Enterprise Home Screen, which ac accomplishes exactly that. Just provides the applications and the screens that the specific user is allowed to use and he or she can't navigate outside or just has to keep everything on the same screens and the same applications themselves. Fantastic. Thank you guys for your time today, that's really appreciated. If anyone would like some more insights and information on mobility DNA, please go to zebra.com.